thank you everyone who's come out. Uh, I can't tell you how lovely it is for our family to see you supporting us tonight. Uh, Bo, thank you for your kind words. Bo, 11 years ago, started us as we sought out the race for state representatives. So I told him tonight, I didn't want anybody else to introduce me. He had kind of good luck thing going on. I would keep that. But you have come to a place that's very special to us. Uh, our children are the sixth generation who grew up on this farm who came to be a part of East Tennessee. And uh, my wife, you know, is, is here. Uh, our children, Lindsay, Reagan, Joe, and uh, Governor Allison. Uh, my mother is here. Our sister, my sisters are here. And many relatives, neighbors, friends, business associates. It, it just means everything to us to see you here. Uh, several of my colleagues, national elected officials, and, and people who have served with there and on the local level, many are here tonight. But really, it's not to come and talk about me. Some of those words have already been said, and they were kind, and I appreciate those. But it really is to come to tell us how we're going to help you. Because when I travel and when I come around events, or I just go to a ball game, or I go where people are, I want to listen to what you told me, and I've tried to do that. And I've heard a handful of things that I will just repeat tonight that are about you. And those things are, we believe in America. We believe in the foundation of America. We believe in the Constitution. And we believe that the federal government should be very small, not large. We believe that people should be responsible for their own actions, not a bureaucrat. Jimmy, we want to know that you're going to go to Washington and make the government less in our lives, not more in our lives. We want you to know that we want the foundations of liberty and the defense of Christian values to be prominent. As a matter of fact, we want religious liberty to be lifted back up to the place it had been for the time of our Constitution. way by serving in Nashville. That's what I've enjoyed doing. That's what I think I've been able to help in some ways to some of you. But now we think there's a different window. We think there's a different season. We think there's a chance that we can take what you want, what these Tennessee people really believe, and extend that into the areas in Washington. You know, our country is adrift. I don't have to tell you that. I don't have to tell you what is going on around us. I read this morning in Joshua chapter 4 where they spoke at that time about stones, 12 stones being placed in an area. It wasn't because those stones had incredible significance to them, and it really was so generations who came forward were going to ask what those stones were for. We've had a debate in our nation over the last few weeks about stones and monuments and what they're for. While I won't wait into that debate, I will say I'm not going to be a part of rewriting history. I'm not going to be a part of going to I want to be brief because you come, you spend your time, you've enjoyed us. And I hope you've come to stay. We've got more sunlight. We'd love to have you here longer. But I want you to leave with a couple of thoughts. We want to serve you. That's part of what we really desire. What happens tonight is our launch. We want to leave from here with an excitement that we can make a difference in your lives. Our family is committed to making this 12-month journey really successful. We've invested in the time it takes, the resources it takes. We want you to join with us. We need you to join with us. It's a big fight. It's a long battle. But we've got lots of friends. And I just have to tell you tonight, it matters so much that you come out to be a part of this. And we want to have an opportunity together for our children, our grandchildren, and those who come behind us to say, somebody, somewhere, at one point in time, cared enough, made himself out on a Saturday night where they saw 
our country, it is great. It's a wonderful place to be. And tonight, we want to thank you again and tell you it's our soul, it's our heart to give you our pledge. You allow us to serve you. You'll not be disappointed. You'll not be embarrassed. And we'll make this opportunity to make East of the Day even a more wonderful place to live. Thank you so very much for being here. This makes us so happy, and thanks to you. This has been a wonderful night. God bless you. God bless our great country. And God bless the state of Tennessee. Thanks for coming with us.